This is a reminder of how to get to the databases on the Donors for Public Library. When you're on your iPad, go ahead and click on Safari. And in this search bar, you can type in Downers Grow Library. And then I'm going to click Go. When I scroll down, I could click on Downers Grow Public Library here, but it will actually be faster if I click on Kids, because that is the site that I want to go to. Now this next page will look a tad different. Um, I'm using my phone instead of my iPad, so yours um, with the homework help, it will be in the middle and it will have a little green symbol behind it. So you want to click on homework help. And down here you would want to click on see all kids resources. This will take you to all of the databases. Now here they are listed alphabetically. I am going to scroll down to power knowledge life science. So I'm going to click on this. This is where it will ask you to log in with your Downers Grove Public Library card that is provided by your teacher and it might be up in your classroom as well. Um, it does start with 2119. Uh, because that is an account just for our schools, I'm going to stop this and be right back. I typed in the library code number and clicked log in and here I am in the database of Power Knowledge Life Science. So I can scroll down, click on a couple tabs, or search for something specific here. If you do want to get out um, of this specific database and go to a different one, you can click on this symbol and go back to the databases that were provided. So let's say that I wanted to go into BookFlix. The nice thing is since I already put in that library code, um, I do not need to log in again, so I can scroll down and look at BookFlix. And again, if I want to go to a different database, I can click on the windows that are open in Safari and go back to my databases that are here. So those are some reminders of how to log in and access your Downers Grove um, database.